Hello disciples, um, I am now in Lagos, Nigeria. I came in two days ago and I promised that either the last video or the next one I do would be in Nigeria. I've been here for since Tuesday morning. I've gone on some appointments and now let's get back to doing, um, well let's go back, get back to telling my story. So we became a solar company in the last one. So this is chapter five. Lessons that we've learned. One, um, just because someone has passed, has taken a course, does not make them an expert. We hired someone from Ghana who we believed was an expert. And yes, he knew uh, the electrical part, but the DC part he was very weak in. And um, they turned out to be expensive in terms of resources. Number two, you as a business, you cannot run a business from a distance and you cannot run a business without knowing what's going on. So you have to know as much about the product you're installing and the installation process as the people you hire to do it. I did not know that. I learned that after we completed our first set of installations. Number three, quality matters. You cannot, there's no shortcut. Yes, I had the ego um, trip that made me want to have my name on the product but at the end of the day I was offering pardon the French shitty products that wound up not only costing me more money but also cost me reputation wise you're a new company you're looking to get out of the gates start with a quality offering finally they can do attitude you can do it all you have to do is try and you know you can do it so we've learned three very expensive lessons um, we had equipment that failed but that's not relevant the most relevant part was that we actually got up uh, started a company brought in people uh, went out and installed something we've never done before and that part of it execution we we're very successful at so I'm going to leave you with um, this lesson did we execute? Yes. Did we do what we set out to do as a solar company? The answer is a categorical yes. Were there any lessons we learned during that time? Yes, there were some huge lessons. So if you like what I have to say, please give me a thumbs up. Uh, if you've not subscribed, click subscribe below. And um, the next video will give you a little more details as to how we've run the company, how we've corrected mistakes, how we've grown, uh, our challenges with recruiting and finding good employees and uh, we'll address that in the next video so thank you very very much again this is Christopher Masaya coming to you from Lagos Nigeria take care